Hello friends and welcome to Day to Day with Ray. With me, Ray Ray. So I want to say hello, hi, how are you? Um, I'm feeling better. Um, I still got this laryngitis stuff still going on. For some reason... <laughs> Luna says hello. Um, <laughs> so it seems like every time I get sick, sometimes I'll get laryngitis. So my mom loves to talk to me because she it was so funny because every time I get sick like this and every time I talk to her she makes me laugh on purpose because I sound hysterical to her thanks mom um but yeah so we just got back from my favorite place <clears throat> the Dollar Tree so today I want to do something different with my Dollar Tree haul which or shopping whatever you want to call it um I'm going to show you everything that I bought, including all of my everyday stuff, every weekly stuff that I buy. So, um, plus I got some Christmas stuff. So this will start with the first bag that's closest to me, which is Christmas. Um, I did get, they had these really cute um, refrigerator magnets for Christmas, I think. They're really neat. If you see on the back, you can like put them together. You can put like Santa's head on a reindeer, yada, yada, yada. But I think it would be really fun. And I'm going to put these. Me, I'm sure my son will love to do them. Um, I also got this random pink bowl. <laughs> and the reason why I got this bowl is because um, I'm doing a show tomorrow. I think I said I'm doing like this handbag bingo. And um, it's a fundraiser for this uh, little girls dance school. And I have all these glow in the dark charms and they're not really selling. I've had them for like over a year now. I even have them on my Etsy store for a dollar. Nobody's buying them. <coughs> it's mainly like letters and there's some random stuff. I'm dumping them all in a bowl and I'm putting like four or five for a dollar, like for real, and then see if they sell. This is going to be a bunch of little girls, you know, so hopefully that works. The other thing I bought is um, they have these uh, jewelry boxes because I do sell jewelry. So they have um, the four, three different size jewelry boxes. And, um, <coughs> excuse me. So when somebody says, you know, like when they make a purchase, they'll say, oh, is this a gift? You need a jewelry box for an extra dollar. So, yeah. So I got, they have these real pretty gold ones. I don't know how well you can see the pattern on it. Um, they have these really pretty red ones. I didn't get many. You see my little setup in the reflection? On well, my little uh, uh, fondant container. And these, these are my favorite. And then I just got two um, regular packs of white. That way, if they want to wrap them themselves, they can wrap them themselves, which is fine. So I got that. And then in this little, this is so cute. I don't know where I'm going to hang it, but I'm going to hang it somewhere. And it says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. And it's so cute. I thought it was cute. You could probably make this. It's like made out of um pressed cardboard, but I, you know, and it's just, you know, before a buck. I mean, come on. It's really cute. I could have probably made this, but like I said, it's it was a dollar. And it was adorable. I got that so that's gonna go down in the Christmas tote so let's get into some of our everyday stuff so I always get the bread from the Dollar Tree seriously I ain't even joking I get the white bread for the boys I prefer um, rye bread is what I eat because apparently it's supposed to be good for your blood sugars and it does help lower your blood sugars and I got me an extra muffin tin and the purpose for this muffin tin is I already started writing out all my plans and for my videos. And <clears throat> one video I'm going to do, um, me and my son are going to make turkeys out of Oreo cookies and candy corns. And um, or during the Christmas holidays, I want to try to do a, some type of vlog every single day. I can't guarantee it because I will be busy. So weekends, you probably won't get one when I have my shows. Um... So, but yeah, but what I want to do with this is because I didn't want to ruin or mess up my really good um, cupcake things. I saw you put the peppermints in here 
put them in the oven, they melt, and then you'll have little peppermint bowls, which what I'm going to do is make cupcakes or a cake pop mixture and put it in there and then decorate them in serve them like that so that's what this is for so it's a dollar if it gets ruined it gets ruined it's just a buck you know it is what it is um also necessities everyday necessities paper towels a dollar i have no problem using paper towels from the dollar store they're actually pretty decent and they last so um uh oh <clears throat> i got the kitties their cat food i'm surprised they're not over here already oh uh, when they hear their bowls they each have a bowl so i put filler bowls up but i got two cans of uh, wet food for them um i get these at the dollar store i mean they're a dollar i know they're a little cheaper at um at like walmart and stuff and you get more but i just got some frosting because i actually um don't have butter so i uh, am making a cake so i'm just going to use their chocolate fudge frosting which is what I already have in between it but I didn't have enough to do the outside and um, I just got a vanilla just to have on hand because I do have some scraps so I want to do some cake pops something and um, I always get these <clears throat> love these things um, they're a dollar you only get four four dollar which is fine but believe it or not I don't really run my dishwasher that often and I actually still have a pack so this is just like a little backup pack um I probably run my dishwasher every other day or every three days because I actually we use paper plates unless we have company and um and I also hand wash a lot of my um pots and pants oh my do you hear these cats <laughs> um I actually hand wash a lot of my pots and pans because um I found that actually putting them in the dishwasher ruins them so I hand wash them and I even put a little oil after I dry them because sometimes I will hand dry especially my Rachel Ray pots and pans I will put a little bit of olive oil on them after just to kind of keep them a little non-stick so uh, what's in this bag oh this is my hubby's bag um so <clears throat> this is my favorite I've always been a gang girl like gang detergent like laundry detergent and then I switched to this brand, but usually the blue is what I normally buy. But I tried this Morning Sun. I don't know if it's it's Suave, uh, Suave I don't know, Suave Teal, Suave Teal, I don't know. I'm sorry if I'm butchering the name. I love this stuff, okay? So um, I actually ran out of this last night. I was doing laundry, but I still have some more of the box because I use this in the wash. And then I put the matching fabric softener sheet in the dryer. So um, I still have the fabric softener sheets, but I didn't have any more of this. So I just grabbed one from a dollar store. This actually does, this smell, the scents do last, let me tell you. And I actually make my own home freshener, like, uh, like the Febreze. Um, I put some of this in a bottle with some water. I spray the curtains, the house. The house smells so good. I do it, um, if not daily, every other day. And the house smells really, really good. But this scent, um, usually it's the blue one, the fresh scent. But this one's called Morning Sun, and it smells really good. First, I wasn't too sure of it, but it grew on me. Then they have these at the dollar store. Coming at you. <laughs> I hate Mountain Dew. My husband will only drink Mountain Dew, which is part of his problems. Let me tell you, I like Mountain Dew is the worst damn soda you can drink, but that's what he likes. Um, so what else did I get? Oh, this is for last. So, um, of course, everyday essentials, paper plates. Um, now I have, I'm actually going to do another video later today. They had, um, candy 50% off. So I got um two bags of candy corn because of our project and candy corn is still for thanksgiving so whatever um i'll put it there um and then i got a pack of baby wipes because that's an essential in this house and i also got orange slices and fruit slices now what I'm going to do with these is I found a tutorial online 
I was searching for fall, autumn, Thanksgiving stuff as I was trying to figure out my videos and what I want to do. Um, I came across a site and what this woman did, now I've made out of those spice drops, I've made roses and I made flowers out of the spice drops. But the orange slices and the fruit slices, um, what I'm gonna do with these is you actually put them in the oven, okay? And you bake them at 350 for like 20 minutes and they melt. And then what you wanna do is um, you put granulated sugar on top of them and you roll them out, put a piece of, put a, put a piece of parchment paper over top of them and you roll them out. And then what you do with that is you take your cookie cutter, which I'm gonna do leaves, and you cut your leaves out. But what she did was she put the whole piece down, but what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna cut them up and so that way I can get more of a variety, a color variety. So you know how like at Christmas time they have like the frosted, like the sugared, the sugared fruits and stuff like that. So that's what that's gonna be, but it's gonna be leaves. So I got this one and I made sure I found the bag with more orange and yellow or more red and yellow and less purple. And there's like one or two greens in here, which I might throw in there, but, um, but yeah, so I got those still. So that's my project. And another part of that project is um, I got, I couldn't find, what was that noise? Um, I couldn't find the regular like little square craft caramels. So I got these Werther Original um, Chewy Caramels. And what I'm gonna do with these is I'm gonna put them in the microwave and I'm gonna shape these into acorns. And I'm gonna put the acorns and the top of the acorn is going to be a Tootsie Roll. So I saw this online too. I could put, when I do that video later, I will link um, the picture that I saw with this. And I will link um, the webpage to make the, um, the leaves. Now, I've never done this before. So this will be a whole trial and error thing. If I mess them up, I mess them up. I might just do a small little batch. Just try to do enough for one. So we'll see what's going. But yeah, so these I'm gonna heat up, shape into an acorn, put a tootsie roll on pop, like on pop, on top, and make a little um, acorn. So it'll be leaves and acorns. I think it'll be so cute. So yeah. And I didn't even buy tootsie rolls because my son got enough from trick or treating, so he'll be just fine. So what else do we got? We got toilet paper, and let me tell you. So this is just a regular bathroom tissue from the um, Dollar Tree. It works just as fine. It's it's actually better than Angel Soft, and I've always used Angel Soft. So, and actually my girlfriend, she even switched to buying it. So, I mean, hey, it is what it is. Now down to my last bag, and we have more candy corn. Um, and then I found these thought these were interesting again because these were all two for a dollar um they're uh pumpkin spice cups i don't know how well you can see that they're pumpkin spice cups um when i made my candy arrangements and i posted them online online i got tons of emails and i think i said that in my one um video and when uh i posted that this lady wants um, she wants me to make her one for Thanksgiving. So I was like, oh, okay, you know, and I also saw, I was like getting so excited at the dollar store. I was like, okay, I can't spend. I just got to get necessities for the most part, which I did. <coughs> and what I got, what I went for. And, um, but they have like the boxes of the Christmas candies now. So they have like the green boxes with the M&Ms and then they have like, the, uh, I was just like, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> so, but um, I got the, um, I got these for um, the one gift basket the lady wants for one for Thanksgiving. She wants like fall theme inspired stuff. So please pray for me that I do pretty decent this weekend. I'm really, okay, these damn cats. I'm really hoping to make, um, I want to make at least 200 bucks. I'm hoping that's my minimum because I have to pay, still have to put towards my bazaar. And um, I have bills and there's some things that I need to get for, you know, whatever, but I'm hoping. So please pray for me. Pray for me. Um, so I also got this. This is just a little cardboard Santa 
Ho, 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 ho. What do you want, boys and girls, for Christmas? Um, I think I might hang him in the window. I really liked him. Uh, and the people were actually scarfing these up, so I just, I snagged him. And I thought this was really cute, just because I'm a big Santa. And it's just like, it kind of looks like the wood, like, palettes, but it's just all one piece. But it says welcome, and it's got Santa on it. Like I said, I love me some Santa. What? You see this? What does that, what does that mean? Do you read that? Formaldehyde? Um, that's a little freaky. I might have to look that up. Um, but yeah, so I just thought he was really cute because I do. I'm a big Santa. I'm a big Santa person. And, um, and then I just got a little thing of tissue paper for some of my stuff because they were really pretty and they didn't really have many of those there. So, um, so that's everything I got from the dollar store. Like I said, that's all my daily stuff, uh, weekly stuff. And that's actually not everything because I actually do buy groceries there too, but I didn't buy um I didn't buy groceries this time. But yeah, so I did that and then on our way back they had this country, Christmas in the country thing at this little teeny tiny church on this little teeny tiny side road. So me and my girlfriend stopped and I got this. It's the Ten Commandments for Firefighters. I don't know if I I don't think I'm gonna give this to him for uh um for Christmas. But I will give it to him maybe for like a whatever present or maybe I'll go hang it up in his room and surprise him for my hubby. And so that's a little Ten Commandments of Firefighters. It says, Thou shalt safeguard the lives and property of others. Thou shalt keep thy station equipment in good condition. Thou shalt not overdo the siren during parades. Thou shalt not honor thy super superior offer officer. Thou shalt honor thy superior officer. Thou shalt not cover covet the another firefighter's assignment thou shall remain alert and ready to respond thou shall keep thyself in good condition thou shalt ask god for strength courage and wisdom thou shalt hug thy family every day and thou shalt consider thyself a hero because thou art one so i got that it's made out of woods from south carolina um it has a little something something on it if i can get that off i don't know but this is a little gift or, you know, I might just save it and put it, like, in a stocking or something. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. And then, for 50 cents, I got my son um, a game, a little um, PlayStation game. It's all PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale. So, I don't, I don't know. It's for PlayStation 3, that's what my son has. So, uh, for 50 cents, it's a PlayStation 3 game. So, he's been doing really good this week, so let him, I got him a game. It ain't gonna break my bank, it was 50 cents, and I still got change in my pocket. So, they had, like, a lot of stuff there, but, so, yeah, so I'm gonna wrap this video up, but that's basically everything in my haul. Like, I mean, like I said, I get my bread there, I get, um, my toilet, my toiletries there, you know, I get my toothbrushes, my, well, except for my shampoo, because I always buy, well, I do buy my shampoo there. Let me not lie. <laughs> I buy the VO5 shampoo for the most part. And then, um, but I don't skimp on my, uh, I just took my shoes off and I felt like I went down shorter. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I, uh, buy my, uh, I always use Dove conditioner, but I do buy VO5 shampoo because I feel like you can buy the cheap shampoo if you buy a decent conditioner. I don't know but um so yeah so that's my video for now I will make a video another can I even talk today <laughs> I am going to make another video later um I gotta get everything put away and I actually might take a nap because my son has had such a rough week he's had a really 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 bad night and he was up again it's like I get a nap from 10 p.m to 12 midnight and then from like a little after 12 midnight to like 3 to 4 in the morning, he is just tossing and turning. He's having nightmares. He's up crying. The last night he was sitting on the steps waiting for me to come upstairs. So last night, well, I had this big charade with my computer too. Like I think I told you I had to reset my whole phone. And so I had to reset my whole phone. And then I had to totally, completely delete my whole computer. I lost everything on my computer 
and I the cats this is basically what happens my cat stepped on it and I lost my mouse like the cursor because I have like a touch screen computer so it's like touch screen and keyboard and it's got like a little pad for the mouse and that's what I usually use the most and um somehow she stepped on it because dummy me I changed my screensaver from the lines to the bubbles and she was trying to get to the bubbles and um so I don't know but basically she messed it up somehow and I had to reset my whole computer it was ridiculous but I'm gonna wrap this up so I will see you guys later today in another video so when I'm making my fruit stuff so all right guys peace love and happiness and remember be kind because you don't know what kind of battle someone's fighting so be kind give somebody a hug and the holidays are coming so now is an extra super time to be super kind even though you should be super kind every day just you know if you see somebody give them a hug if they taser you hey i ain't got nothing to do with that you shouldn't listen to me <laughs> just i'm just kidding i'm just kidding um all right guys again peace out i'll see you later bye